What is up YouTube? I hope everyone's doing well. I want to welcome everyone to today's vlog, vlog number 83. I just got off work. Work was pretty cool. This weekend, uh, my goal is to finish the app and finally share fully with the boot camp that I'm working with and you know what we're doing together. So it's pretty exciting too. You know, what I wanted to do, you know, is usually is what I want to do right now is really just go heart to heart with you guys. Usually I put all this stuff towards the end of the video and I will have something towards the end of the video too. Uh, I usually start the video off with drone footage, but I figured I'd just talk to you face to face or face to camera <laughs> man I'll tell you this guys I'm really really thankful you know for the opportunity that I've had to become a developer the fact that I'm able to learn code and the fact that I'm even even able to program I, mean, I feel very fortunate last night with a friend um, to look at my computer they didn't even know I was a programmer and they saw me like a computer was slowing down and I realized it was because I was running an app in the background through the command line through the terminal and they're slowing down my computer my friend was like pro I didn't know you could code what the where did that come from <laughs> Uh, and the reason I share that is because I realize not a lot of people can do what we do. N not a lot of people can and that's why we do get paid well, that's why we do get taken care of at the company as developers, as programmers, as coders, as software engineers, as software developers, as of software engineers. Same person, same different titles, same job. Uh, I think sometimes we make such a big deal on how many languages we know, on how much we might get paid, but we also have to remember that wow, we get to like work in an industry where so many people think it's impossible to learn but really it's very easy to learn we get to work and have a job that's extremely secure where if I was to get laid off if I was to quit my job because I just don't want to work here I won't find a job like right away but I'll find a job in like one or two months I'd like that's like a hundred percent guaranteed because of our skill set that's if you put in the hard work to get to where you are. The fact that we get to be in this industry is huge. Really, if, if there are people who are watching this who are still not put in, even at least tried out learning code, check out the link in the description below with Team Treehouse. Like, really check it out because, man, Team Treehouse has really changed my life financially and my lifestyle. Or I don't worry, like, am, am I gonna have enough food to eat for the next day or the next week or the next month but I don't even look at the pricing on the menu anymore I'm not saying that's smart I should look at the pricing more but I was thinking about it today uh, even during work like wow right like I don't get paid the best but the fact I get to be in this industry and I don't need a degree I just need hard work and effort and determination and pure will what other jobs are like that in the world out there other than now in the tech industry um, I see people who are trying to hire developers, remote developers, getting paid $80,000 a year and you can work anywhere in the world. This is unheard of. And so that's why I'm also very thankful for this vlog that I'm even able to share my life with you guys. You know, I get to share these experiences I have. I get to share the things I learned, my mistakes, just life in general. And so uh, I thank everyone for the support that you've been giving me as I do these vlogs. So if you haven't, man, you need to learn code. If you haven't yet, you need to do it. Check it out, Team Treehouse, first link in the, in the description below. Check it out, seven day free trial, you have nothing to lose. If you don't like it, cancel it. Just a couple of months, maybe six months, maybe a year, a pure hard work can change your life forever, depending on how much you want to change your life. So, there's a plane on top of me. <laughs> the start of vlog, this is the beginning. Interesting talk, I know it was a rant in the beginning, but I'm excited. Let's begin the vlog, guys. Ready? Let's go. What's up, YouTube? I'm here, I just got a church now, it is Sunday. So this video is together with Saturday, Sunday. I actually didn't really vlog on Saturday. Uh, so, uh, I know that I, I know that um, I, I said that I would post the new video in regards to the app that I'm making by this weekend. I wasn't able to do that. Um, uh, the main reason is because, you know, uh, something happened recently. Uh, within my life uh, Which is probably You know like <laughs> Not gonna cry but <sighs> cried enough <laughs> Probably the hardest thing I've ever got had to go through Hardest thing I've ever got through. I mean with the life that I've been living 
Uh, I've been alive for almost 30 years already. Within the last pretty much 29 years that I've been alive, uh, I've been through some hard things, you know. I've been homeless for a couple months. I've gone through times where, you know, I was in so much agony, so much physical pain. Uh, you know, I've lost loved ones. Uh, my grandma passing away. Um, a friend of mine, like right there in the middle of an event. Um, she was an elderly, but she was a friend of mine. She died literally in my arm. You know, I'm not saying those things aren't bad, and they are, and it's hard, those things are hard to go through. I remember living from not even just paycheck to paycheck. My paycheck couldn't even help me survive. <laughs> um, but I can also say, <laughs> uh, right now, what I'm going through is probably the hardest thing I've ever had to go through, to be quite honest. I'm not saying it's harder than everyone else, but within, like, my life, like, within everything I've gone through in the last 29 years, Dang, this is hard. It is extremely painful. Um, it's so painful to the point that I've been going to the gym too much, you know what I mean? I went to the gym this morning, I worked out, I did a back workout, I did some squats, and I did it because sometimes it's the pain from pushing yourself and working out, you know how you push yourself when you feel that, that little, like that burn? I'd rather feel that than what I feel right now, <laughs> you know? And now, now, I'm back here in the gym, Again, right behind me. <sighs> Dang. I mean, I'm not gonna tell you guys what it is. It's really, really personal, you know? But I'm really out of it. I'm, uh, I'm uh, really, really out of it. Uh, and so, I mean, why am I sharing this is because, you know, this is a vlog where I pretty much share my life and things I go through as a developer and the life of a developer too, you know, and it's hard, but, you know, at least at the end of the day, no matter what, you know, I, I've got, um, I need to uh, learn to really lean on God more, trust in God more, um, really read the word more, pray more, <laughs> really, uh, which is a good thing and which I'm doing more than ever now, but, uh, Dang, man. I mean, I know in these vlogs that I have, I make it as if life seems so good, but, you know, life isn't always perfect. Just because I, ha I have, I'm a developer, I have a job, you know, just because I'm a YouTuber with this channel doesn't mean that life is the best. Uh, I choose to share what I want with you. There's, I think, to be quite honest, with, but within my entire day, I probably only show you 30%, 40% of what goes on in my day. I'm sorry that I haven't been able to pretty much post vlogs lately, like um, I usually do. So I know I've been a little, little bit lagging on the videos lately where I've been posting like two and a half, pretty much like two and a half videos a week. Uh, I'll go back to three videos a week, if not four, pretty much like every other day when I get the chance. If ever, it'll probably be the most three days, but my goal is every other day when I do get the chance. Um, yeah, it's just painful, man. But you know what? Uh, going through hardships like this, Going through hardships like this is what I, I, I know that what you know what's going on right now will only make me stronger. And anyway, getting back onto it. Um, after the gym, uh, I'm gonna go hang out with some friends tonight. Um, after that, though, hang out with friends until maybe 9:30, 10 ish, and from 10 to maybe 1 or 2 a.m. Yeah, man. I mean, you know, I'm going through something right now, and it's like really hard but you know what like I can't you know and everyone else who's going through something hard right now and it's, it's easier said than done okay it's easier said than done but you can't let hardships slow you down you just have to work harder uh, you know uh, you know you have to put in more effort and when you go through hardships yes you're gonna get knocked down over you're gonna get up you can get knocked down that's what I feel right now I get up I get knocked down for a couple hours I get up and I get knocked down over and over and over again. It's like a 12 round fight and I lose every single fight. But the goal is that you keep getting up over and over and over again no matter how many times you get knocked down. There will be a time that when you get knocked down, you get back up and you won't fall anymore. You won't hit to get KO'd, you won't, it won't hurt anymore. You, you, you know, you just get up, keep fighting and you know, you keep, you keep, you keep hustling, right? <laughs> I don't know, maybe I'll end the vlog here. If not, then I'll see you guys in a little bit. I don't even remember what I recorded the last couple days, but I just want to like go out and just drive somewhere. Like just drive somewhere far. I just want to do that, drive somewhere far. 
Alright, I'm gonna see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> Peace. Man, I don't know what to get. Uh, 